semi-final features the double gold medalist in the individual events, Finn Sonnekalb of Germany. And it's those first five or six that will fancy making the top eight. But uh, Representing Germany, Shin Sion Ung of the Republic of Korea will be Norway. hoping to fly the flag Anderson. for Norway. the home nation Anderson. as we meet Japan. our skaters. Takumi Murashita. Ilbon. Murashita Takumi. Kazakhstan. Ruslan Zanadilo. Kazakhstan. Ruslan Zanadilo. Italy. Lorenzo Minari. Italia. Lorenzo Minari. People's Republic of China. Wan Li Zhang. Chungo. Zhang Wan Li. Netherlands. Efre Kornrad. Netherlands. Efre Kornrad. United States of America. Liam Kitchell. Vigo. Liam Kitchell. Republic of Korea. Son Ung Shin. Vigo. Shin Son Ung. Romania. Vlad Popa. Romania. Vlad Popa. Switzerland, Nevio Gross. Swiss, Nevio Gross. Poland, Simon Hostinski. Poland, Simon Hostinski. Portugal, Manuel Piteira. Portugal, Manuel Piteira. Spain, Christopher Lopez Osorio. Spain, Christopher Lopez Osorio. Finland, Eka Rintala. Finland, Eka Rintala. 이렇게 열다섯 명의 선수가 출격하겠습니다. So the 15 skaters will receive their final instructions. Just to make sure everyone, everybody is clear, there will be some intermediate points for sprint finishes after four and seven laps. And then the one that really matters at the end of the tenth and final lap. And uh, the rules very, very simple. If you want to be skating in an Olympic final, make sure you have a top eight finish. And who can catch Finn Sonnekalb there, the tall German? Pretty much all in black with that number one on his helmet. If you could design a speed skater from scratch as a prototype, that is the body shape that you would design. He is built for this sport. And as we've already seen in the individual events, he was uh, just in a class of his own, just 16 years old, and is going to be... A very, very accomplished senior speed skater. Of that, there is no doubt at all. Ready. Well, all eyes will be, of course, on the tall German, Finn Sonnekalb, who just leads off here. And it does seem to be, when you look at this group, it's uh, Sonnekalb and seven others. For so qualifiers, the uh, main contenders will be uh, Takumi Murashita. Eric Anderson of Norway and Ruslan Janadikov, Lorenzo Minari, we saw him skate well in the uh, individual skates as well. Zhang of the People's Republic of China, Joffrey Kunrad is pretty handy. Liam Kitchell and Shin Sion Ung of the Republic of Korea. Those are going to be our main contenders going by individual form. And if you counted the names as I was reading them, you would have heard nine names, but only eight can advance. And you never know, someone might pop up out of the uh, second rank of skaters. We've seen it happen already in the women's competition. We saw the lowest ranked Portuguese skater in uh, semi final number one finish second. So anything can happen. You get it right on the day. Sonic Alb is quite happy to let uh, somebody else do the heavy lifting. And, uh, Anderson, it is, of Norway, who's decided to uh, make a move here with Zhang Wan Li of uh, the People's Republic of China just behind him. And that's a nice move on the inside from Ruslan Zhenadikov. And it's he that decides to uh, stretch things out. Anderson sticking with him. And at the moment, right at the back, almost dead last is... Uh, Finn Sonical, he's very happy just to be sitting in 14th place here. As uh, let some of the uh, pretenders wear themselves down. It is uh, Janadilov continuing to lead Zhang around here as we come to the bell. It's the first intermediate skate. Uh, very much at the back there. It uh, is still Sonical, quite happy just to sit back. Oh, we've seen a slide out. Not 100% sure who that was. It might have been Lorenzo Minari. We'll await uh, confirmation of that. But uh, meanwhile, no such concerns for Zhang Wanli. He will uh, take this first intermediate sprint ahead of Ruslan Zhenadinov and uh, Eric Anderson of Norway. Mm. 
And there's confirmation of what happened in sprint number one. It is indeed Lorenzo Minari of Italy that has picked himself up. And uh, not out of this. I mean, there's some... Uh, there's an awful lot of work to be done for Minari. But uh, they'll slow down as they build. But uh, it would be very, very hard for him to uh, get back from there. As you can see, he's badly detached. Eka Rintala of Finland struggling to just keep with this lead group. But when they slow and bunch, Minari's thinking, well, I've got a chance. I might be able to catch him up. But uh, so much still for him to try and claw back here. And when he does get back... He's going to need to find his second win. Everyone's having a look. Everyone's having another look, aren't they? And uh, that's Janadilov again. Making his move, and they're really bunched it. And away goes Janadilov again, with Anderson sticking with him. We've got the American, Liam Kitchell, up amongst the uh, front runners here as well, along with Geoffrey Kunrad. But uh, the Dutchman getting detached a little bit as Takumi... Murashita of Japan takes closer order, but this is a Norway USA 1 2 here with Anderson leading Kitchell and Janadilov trying to hold off contenders either side of him for third place. And he's not going to do it. I think that's going to be a Korean third place. We'll await confirmation. Shin, I think, just may have held off, but that was mighty close at the line. They still haven't officially confirmed it in the stadium. That was a photo finish for third. But right now, it's Anderson and Kitchell. Shin and uh, Murashita, who were involved in that duel for third place. It's Shin who has been confirmed as taking it. And now, they're seeing another move. And there's confirmation of the, uh, the bonus points. And uh, we're seeing Nevio Gross the Swiss skater and look who's popped up on his shoulder there he is Finn Sonnekal but uh, Gross was not expected to be among the leaders but here he is and there's a gang of seven of them have broken away so if you're in that group you're feeling pretty optimistic Sonnekal has decided yep yeah, I'll show you guys what this game is all about he sat at the back and then he just said right catch me if you can Sonakal in a league of his own here. I mean, he doesn't even need to be doing this, but I think he's in a comfort zone here. They're all trailing behind him. And Sonakal will win this by a mile standing up. Oh. I mean, that was contemptuous ease that Finn Sonakal won that semi-final. My goodness me. It's going to take something extraordinary to keep that man off the top of the podium. Eric Anderson... Liam Kitchell, Jeffrey Kunrad, strong finishing as well. Takumi Murashita and Shin Sionung were up there as well. Nevio Gross was part of that group. And the big surprise was the fast finishing. Lorenzo Minari, who did have that crash out. I mean, he's right at the back there. The Italian skater looks completely out of it there. But I think he might be involved in a photo finish for that eighth spot. I think he's just going to miss out. He was mighty close. What a fairy tale that would have been, but it's Sonic Alban Anderson. Kunrad picking up those bonus points. Taking that third place finish will move ahead of Liam Kitchell, Zhang Wanli, Takumi Murashita, Shinsion Un, and it's Ruslan Janadikov who's just edged out Nevio Gross. Courtesy of those points. That was the importance there. With the points spread over the eight skaters. They advance. Everybody else misses out.